Hello, I'm Giuliano Hazan, and I'd like to tell you about my latest cookbook, Hazan Family Favorites. In this book, I talk about the food traditions that I grew up with and what have become favorites in my family today. Those of you who are familiar with my mother, Marcella Hazan, knew that I was fortunate to grow up eating very well. But it wasn't just because of what she cooked. I was also privileged to enjoy the cooking of two other women with exceptional cooking skills, my two grandmothers, Nonna Giulia and Nonna Mary. Nonna Giulia and Nonna David were Sephardic Jews that lived in Italy and fled to the U.S. just before the Second World War. I remember eagerly looking forward to Friday night Shabbat dinners at their house. The aromas that came from Nonna Giulia's kitchen drew not only our family, but also friends and neighbors. My grandparents spoke Ladino, and legend has it that their ancestors can be traced back to 15th century Spain. The food my grandmother cooked was influenced by the cultures and cuisines of the many places that my ancestors wandered. I remember the little pies she called boraquitas, filled with spinach and also with feta cheese and ricotta. Bamia, or baked okra, was also one of my favorites, as well as her amazing baklava. You could say that my family's food traditions are the result of culinary crossroads. My maternal grandmother, Nonna Mary, whose family lived in Italy, was born in Beirut and grew up in Egypt and then settled in Italy. She made these zucchini filled with rice and meat that were remarkably like my Nonna Giulia's. She also made these wonderful crisp onion and potato fritters that to me seemed exactly like latkes. I rediscovered these and many other gems in a 56-year-old journal that my mother made notes in when she first married my father, who, as she put it, could put up with a lot of things, but not a bad meal. In this book, I share my food memories of my family, as well as many other stories. Buon appetito.